what's what's the feelings in the clubhouse right now after that after that result? Well, you know, the team's disappointed. Obviously, um, I thought both teams had their chances to win the game. Um, you know, we uh, we settled on a curfew before the game started, and, and uh, ended up the curfew ended up getting us. But I really liked the way our team competed. I, being down, uh, what we were down in two situations, um, and I thought those guys battled back. Give our offense credit; they were relentless today and put us in a position to win it. Unfortunately, we didn't. But take away the positive, thought it hit the bad, and you know from from what I heard and what I saw. But obviously, they saw something different. So we've got some video that I'll look at it and review it and see and we'll go from there but uh, you know I you know that I don't think that one play you know won or lost we had some situations where we had to do some things better and put ourselves in a position and finish that game we didn't do that today. Would you say the three errors today were just more mental errors? On the well we just we just didn't handle the ball well today we've been playing very solid defense and today was a day where um, you know there's two three plays that I thought we could make and we come again and we play that, get those same three hops. We, you know, we probably make those plays today. It was a, a typical college baseball game with the wind blowing out. You look at the scoreboard, a lot of crooked numbers up there and a lot of heads, a lot of runs scored today. Jake Sanford toured up the whole month of March and then on the very last day of March, five RBI, four hits, another home run. How, how incredible is this month? Been uh, he's, been, he's been really good. I mean, it's been uh, unbelievable to watch what he's done. And the, the biggest thing about it is, He's remained confident in his ability and, and his approach. He hasn't changed his approach. He just goes about his business. I mean, there, there's no, um, what you see is what you get. He's a down to earth person who, um, you know, is a tremendous uh, student athlete here at Western. And we're proud to have him. What kind of pitch would you make for the people that select the national national awards, national hitter of the month? What kind of pitch would you well, make? Well, when you look at the numbers, uh, you can't, you can't help but look at the numbers. The numbers uh, speak out. They'll jump off the page uh, off you. And, it's not like he's done it um, in, a, in a weak conference. He's done it in a strong conference. Conference USA is one of the top conferences in the country. He saw some great arms, and he's doing it against some, some very good teams, very good teams. So um, I, I'd say it speaks for itself if you really dive into it and understand the numbers and where what he's done this month. Is he more improving with the pitching overall throughout the season? I have, I have. Today, today was one of those days. It didn't, we tried everything. We've tried a bunch of different guys going out there. Um, Hopefully, uh, Reese Calvert will be okay. You know, Reese came out early today, but uh, hopefully he'll be ready to go. We'll get, a, get him looked at, and, and uh, we'd love to have him back for sure.